And for your Toyota Sports Report, it was an impressive list of inductees at the North Country Sports Hall of Fame dinner last night in Carthage. Mel Bussler emceed the event and has the story. The Carthage Elks Club, the site, as eight more members were inducted into the North Country Sports Hall of Fame. Among the inductees, former Major League Manager and Carthage native Dave Tremblay. He managed the Orioles from 2007 to 2010. Well, it's a special moment and, um, you know, getting an opportunity to relive the, probably the best part of my life coming back here to Carthage. It's, um, it's quite a thrill and an honor and I'm just overwhelmed that the response that Ed and everybody with the North Country Sports Hall of Fame has put together. It'll be a fun night. Also inducted former Carthage lacrosse coach Kirk Venequatro. He compiled 458 career wins. 24 Frontier League championships and six Section 3 championships. Well, it, it is quite an honor and, uh, you know, I'm uh, humbled by it for sure. Um, I've had, like you said, I've had some time for it to sink in and uh, took some advice from my friends and, uh, you know, longtime friends and they said, you know, to, uh, to enjoy the night, relish the night and uh, don't be afraid to enjoy the night. Also being honored, former Immaculate Heart Athletic Director Mike Delaney. Delaney compiled over 500 wins as coach of the IHC boys basketball team. He also led the Cavaliers baseball team to the 2006 New York State Championship. Well, it's uh, certainly a, an honor and a very humbling uh, award uh, to be selected with so many prestigious, outstanding coaches. Cynthia Wetmore is no stranger to Hall of Fame inductions. The Beaver River product has had a stellar career as a coach at the high school and college levels. She's been a fixture at Cortland State. Yeah, I'm, I'm really proud to be um, inducted into this Hall of Fame. I am, I'm, I'm proud to be from the North Country. Um, the lessons that you learn when you grow up in northern New York about work ethic and community and family all have stuck with me through the years. And, uh, it's definitely helped me in my coaching career and my playing career. Also inducted the late Stan Moore, Donald Dutch Grant, along with the late Henry Coffeen, and Stanley Cup champion Jimmy Howard, who couldn't make the ceremony. A special night for all involved. They're always great nights, Mel. Um, I think every class is special in its own way, and uh, this was just an unbelievable evening to get us kind of back on the right steps, I think, after a couple-year hiatus. This is the first year we've gone back to our original process. We didn't have to wait um, a year or two, so the 2023 was getting back to normal, and the, the, the excitement in this room and everybody that was so great to, uh, to see these inductees this year can't wait to keep do, keep going in other years and uh, start the day uh, tomorrow, probably working on uh, next year. A night to remember at the Carthage Elks Club.